Hi, Chanel. Hi, Corinthia. What's up, Bree? What's up, A. Wu? Hey, Tegan. Hey, Kia. What's up, y'all? Happy Sunday. Sorry, I'm a couple minutes late. I had a couple technical difficulties. Hey, Tab. What's up, Star? Hey, Jovette. What's up? What's going on, Wanda? How y'all doing? <clears throat> Hi, Tane. What's up, Lisha? What is going on? What's up, Dear Renee? What's going on? How y'all doing? What's up, Star? I need to come to these more often. Definitely, Star, you got to. Come hang out in the live. Come hang out. I'm glad to be cooking today, but we can hang out for a little bit afterwards as well, because I'm definitely going to, I want to try these um, on camera as well. I want to eat with y'all. Hi, Shanti. Hey, Ayana. What's up, Tamara? What's up, Muffin Booty? I made it. Yay. What's up? What's going on, y'all? It's good to see y'all. Y'all, can y'all see my logo in the upper right-hand corner? Do you see my logo? The like, I'm Because I'm trying this platform out. I tested it last night, but this is my first time officially like using it like this. Can y'all see my logo in the corner where it says good as can be and like the little avatar of me? Hey, Jessica. What's up, Sheila? Hey, Karen. What's up, Erica? You can see it. This thing is dope, y'all. I really like this platform a lot. Okay, cool. So y'all can see it. Cool. Dang, this platform is so easy to use. Okay, cool. So what's up, y'all? How the day going? <clears throat> man, y'all, uh, man, this day started off a little rocky. If y'all came to, let, you know, last night I did the testing, right, to see if I could work this thing, see if it was going to, um, you know, connect. Y'all, tequila one last night. Tequila one, and I didn't even feel like I drank that much, but I feel like I'm going to have to stop drinking tequila. I think so. I think so. Um, me saying, hey, Muffin Booty, that's, that's somebody's name. <laughs> that's Muffet Booty. That's Muff Muffet Booty in here. Got off work early. Oh, you got off work early. Good. <laughs> All right, y'all. So I'm excited. I'm really excited about cooking. <clears throat> well, let me see if y'all tequila one. Yeah, tequila definitely one. <sighs> I was doing too much last night. And you know how when you drink it, you don't feel it? So you just keep on drinking like, oh, I'm going to be good. No. Okay. Toe up this morning. Like, I really just started feeling better about two hours ago. But I woke up in the middle of the night. Mouth was all dry. Thank you, Lychee. Is it Lychee? I said the same. No more tequila. I'm good. I need I need to stick to dark. I think that's the solution. Just drop it in to say, hey, what's up, Nesby? Thank you for coming through. I appreciate you. Hey, Justina. <clears throat> I love how this is so dope. I love this. Like, I can see that where you guys are commenting from, from Facebook or YouTube. What's up, Don? Don from California. What part of California you in? I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do today. Might bring my kids to the park so they can run off <laughs> some of this crazy energy. Hey, Connie, what's going on? How you doing? I cannot get down with tequila. It gives me real bad headache every time. Man, my body is telling me leave this shit alone, and I think it's about that time. I mean, matter of fact, tequila was the reason that we was towed up and took a five-hour nap in Vegas. Yeah, I, I think I need to stop drinking tequila. I think it's time. Pickle juice to the right. Oh, that, you know what? And you done told me that time and time again, Chanel. And I forget every single time, but we always got pickle juice. What's up, Smalls? What's going on? How you doing? Good to see you. Hey, Michelle. Hey, Eris. I had to give up clear almost a decade ago. Listen, and you've been good ever since, huh? I think it's time for me to go ahead and give it up. I'm sipping on a large strawberry and banana smoothie. It's cold. I don't drink alcohol. Mm, I need to not drink, but I'm not there yet. <laughs> Hi from Albuquerque, the land of entrapment. Entrapment? Why you say that? I want to come to the um, hot air balloon festival out there in New Mexico. Hi Fergie, I'm just getting up. I feel like I had to get, up, but I was just with my newborn. <laughs> How you been feeling? You feeling better? I remember you told me you was you was feeling sick, like a couple months ago. You was feeling sick. So I hope everything is good with you. Good with the baby. Um. I'm going to give it a couple more minutes, y'all, and I'm going to go ahead and get started because I know it takes a minute sometimes to, like, send out the notifications and all that stuff. So what else y'all got going on today? I'm trying to watch the game. Anybody been watching the NBA playoffs? Aaliyah, what's up? What's going on? How you doing? Maryland in the house. Hey, Jamia. Hey, Dash. What's up? What's going on, y'all? How y'all doing? Yeah, we're all good. Good. Good, good, good. Let me – Okay. I'm finna go eat now. Mm, this about to be my. This is the not the second first thing I ate when I woke up because I was down, y'all. I had to eat some food. I had some um, some chips with this um, cheese sauce. What's up, chocolate girl? Eats. What's up, sis? What's going on? How you doing? It's good to see you. Hey, Shonda. You just got done grilling. What you make? 
give me like three minutes. I got to get myself together. Oh, no problem. Yeah, I'm going to wait a couple more minutes. What's up, Joe? We're headed to a pool party. Ooh. See, that's where I need to be. That's what I need to do. Y'all, this platform also allows other people to come in here, too. I can have up to 10 people on here with me at the same time, which is pretty dope. I always forget about the playoffs, but I am watching WNBA regular season games today. Okay. Yeah, I'm about to drive. Come to Balloon, the Balloon Festival. It's amazing. It's actually the land of enchantment, but uh, <laughs> us transplants get stuck here, hence <laughs> entrapment. What's going on, Phoebe? What's going on? How you doing? Happy Sunday to you. Yeah, this is going to be a quick and easy meal, y'all. Super easy. Um, something that you could take um, to a party, like a quick, like if you want to make something quick, I think it not, you don't have to spend a whole lot of money to make it. Um, this is, it's quick and easy, quick and easy. I think the hard, the longest part of it is going to be just cooking it in, um, cooking the bacon in the oven. My last day in Hawaii and I don't feel the best. Tequila was also the culprit for me. <laughs> What's up, Cora? You enjoying your vacation? Damn, I'm telling you, I'm going to stop drinking tequila. I think I'm done. I think last night was my final sign because I really don't feel like I had that much. Hey, Rhonda, stopping by to say hey and everyone happy Memorial Weekend. Yes, happy Memorial Weekend to you as well, Ree. Thank you for coming through. I had a dream about a hot air balloon. I should definitely consider that. It'll be lit. Thanks for the info. Have you ever been in a hot air balloon before? Tell me, have y'all ever been in one before? Y'all, I've only done it once. I went to Arizona to do it. Went to Arizona specifically to go hot air to take a hot air balloon ride. And I think I may have told y'all this. Like low key, low key. We had to do like an emergency landing. Um, shit was getting real dangerous toward the end. And I'm thinking about it. I wasn't as scared as I thought I was going to be. Definitely we would have failed. We probably would have. I don't think we would have died. We would have just broke some stuff though, for sure. But it was, it, it got real, it got crazy. We missed our, um, our landing. We had to go over this gap. Y'all, we were literally about to land on top of a gas station. And then we landed in like this random ass field. Like it was crazy. It was crazy. I don't know that I would do that again. So I want to come to the hot air balloon festival, but I don't want to get in the hot air balloon now. I need to gather my funds and come out to Cali. Come out here. I can't wait to see the recipe. I love quick and easy meals. Yes, very easy. This is low carb. This is keto. All of that, y'all. So we're making ranch. We are making, and you know, obviously you could just grab your own favorite ranch, but I hadn't made ranch in a long time. So I was trying to like master this recipe and look at my ranch, y'all. This is the ranch that I made on Friday. So look at my ranch. This is the ranch we're going to make today. So check out my ranch, y'all. Homemade ranch. Y'all see that jiggle? Got the little jiggle with it. So it turned out good. It turned out really good. Um, hi Rhonda. I'm happy to catch this cooking tutorial. God bless you. What's up, Twinkie? What's going on? It's good to see you. I will get in one with you, but don't get bad <laughs> if I act a fool. I'm afraid of heights. <laughs> listen, listen, I don't I can't even believe my girlfriend at the time she talked me into doing that shit. She was a super, she's super adventurous. I don't feel I feel like I've become adventurous because of that relationship, but um, yeah, no. Mm -mm. I'm good on that shit. Now, I do want to jump off of a mountain into some water, though. And not like a, you know, like a cliff, but not a high ass cliff, though. Not a super, super high one. Something that's not too dangerous. But I would love to do that. And every time I talk about it, my mom gets freaked out. So what's going on, AC? What's happening? It's good to see you. Ready for the chicken jalapeno poppers with ranch dressing? Yes, we're about to get started in just a second. Um, I love making homemade ranch, too. I need to make it more often. I can't believe that I haven't been making it. It also makes me realize how processed... And how much shit ranch has in it. You know what I'm saying? Like this, because you take it, it just it tastes different, but it tastes really good though. Um, what's up, Extina? What's going on? Good to see you. Happy Sunday to you. Thank you for everybody that's in here. Please get a live a thumbs up if you haven't done so already. All right, y'all, let's go ahead and get started. So we're gonna start with the poppers first because I'm gonna put them, you know, they go, they need to cook for about 15, 20 minutes to let the bacon cook. Um, and while that's in the oven, we'll make the ranch. All right. That sounds crazy. So no to jumping off of a mountain. I love me a good ranch. Why don't why don't you make yours? Oh, I ain't trying to nah. I ain't trying to sell no ranch. Nah, hell no. Nah. Mm -mm. That just seemed like too much. I feel like if, if I ever decided to do a sauce, y'all, I would never make my own sauce. I mean, like, yes, I would make it, come up with a recipe, but I would have to go through a manufacturer. Um, and my hats off to anybody that is making their own sauce because you gotta like quality control the hell out of that to so consistently have the same sauce over and over and over again, that's a lot. So I got to leave that to the professionals. That's why I decided not to make my own seasoning like at home or anything like that. Um, yeah, I just, I, I love that I can, that I, a professional company does my spices for me. 
and that's it. So I'm from Fresno, not too far from Steph. Okay. Great Sunday. What's up, Robin? Wingstop has Fire Ranch. Mm -hmm. I need that recipe. I'm ready for these poppers. I'm going to try them this week. Yes. All right. Let's get started, y'all. All right. So first things first, I got my chicken. All right. Got my chicken, y'all. Now, I use the rotisserie chicken. Okay. So I use rotisserie chicken because I didn't feel like, you know, like doing the chicken, cooking it, boiling, da 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 I just picked up a rotisserie chicken and I took the breast off of it and I shredded it. So this is what it looks like. All right. So we got that. <clears throat> And the next thing that I'm about to do is I'm going to add my cream cheese in, and I'm also going to add in my buffalo sauce. And that's all we need for the filling, y'all. It's super easy. That's what I'm telling y'all. Super duper easy. And this is the sauce that I'm using, y'all. I'm going to be using Sweet Baby Ray's buffalo wing sauce. This sauce is really, really good. I love Sweet Baby Ray's sauces, all of them. All right, so I got that. And also, let me open up my cream cheese. So let me see how much of this I need. What's up, see the dopest? What's going on? Can y'all see okay? Y'all good? All right, so this is why I was telling y'all to make it room temperature because it makes it easy to kind of work with, it, you know? So you know how it is when cream cheese is hard. It's hard to, you know, it's hard to mix it around. So I'm probably going to end up using all of this, actually. I'm going to use all of it. All right, so I got all of my cream cheese in. And I want to play some music, but I'm so damn afraid to get a copy. You can't play nothing. But the copyright claims and shit. So anyways, I'm going to go ahead and add in some sauce, and I'm going to see how I feel about that. Ooh, this is so easy. Ooh, that sauce smells good. All right, y'all, so mixing this in. I'm going to taste this. I don't think I need to add anything to this. I don't think I will, but I'm going to taste it and see how I feel about it. All right, super duper. Easy. That's the best thing about popper too, is that you can really just make it your own. Like, whatever you want to put in, your favorite things. I think that's the best thing about it. Like, and I usually always use cream cheese for my filling, um, for any kind of poppers that I do make. And then just kind of add in whatever you like, your favorite meats. You can add in vegetables. You can do all kinds of stuff. So, all right. So, that's it. This is it for the filling, y'all. That is all I'm adding in. Let me grab a fork real quick so I can taste. I want to see what this tastes like. Mm. That is bomb. That is good too. I think I want a little bit more. I put a little bit more wing sauce. I love the stainless steel bowl too. That's it, y'all. I'm literally done with the filling. That is it. So we're gonna move on to our jalapenos. Now, I think sometimes people kind of stay away from jalapeno poppers because they think that there's I mean jalapenos because they're spicy. All you got to do is make sure you take out the seeds. That is the biggest thing that you need to do, okay? So you would take a jalapeno, cut it in half, and remove the seeds. So you can see that I removed the seeds from all of, from all of mine. And what I do, just to make sure I have all the seeds out, um, I run it, I just run them under the water real quick, you know, just to make sure I've, if I've missed any seeds. When I run the water over, that usually gets everything out. That's all you got to do. Besides that, it's not going to be hot. Like once you take the seeds out. I introduced Chloe to Buffalo Chicken Dip. She loves it. Mm -hmm. It's good. Already got my mouth watering. <laughs> all right. So that's it, y'all. So I got my popper. I got my jalapenos. Let me pack these dry real quick. I'm excited about making the ranch. I'm gonna pat these dry real quick, y'all. Definitely try. It's easy, super easy. And I want to tell you what I did too. So we're <clears throat> we're gonna be wrapping. <clears throat> kind of got in my mouth a little bit. Uh, I'm getting rid of the seeds. So be careful with jalapenos, y'all, and make sure you wash your hands thoroughly 
once you're done taking your seeds out. Um, you know what? I just took the it's two. I used two breasts. I used two breasts. All I used was one rotisserie chicken, and that is it. I used one rotisserie chicken. Hey, mama. Hey. Um, hey, Joni, what's going on? How you doing? So I'm gonna go ahead and dry these. Y'all was looking for Auntie Nisi. Oh yeah. So. Hey, GP fam. How you doing? Happy Sunday. What you got? Did you you got done yet? What you mean, girl? I'm hungry. Girl. <laughs> Not miss I cook two times a year. <laughs> I'm swear. Uh, also, too, y'all, I'm sorry, I forgot to say this. Please preheat your oven to 375. I'm sorry. So preheat the oven. To, I should have said that first. Preheat the oven to 375, y'all. I heard you said something about what the peppers. How, how come you uh, didn't take the seeds out with, like, uh... I took them out already. I know, but why did you use your hands? I like using my hands. I don't know why. Oh, okay. I, mean, I don't know why. I, just, I don't know why I do that, but I, that's how I do it every single time. Oh, okay. But also, too, I, was, I mean, everybody's skin is different. Because remember I was telling you what happened to Sorrel, how, like, the, the it's stuck in her hands? Yeah. It doesn't do that to me. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm just putting my two cents in. No, I know. The hair is late, Miss Ma'am. I see you. Thank you. Oh, thank you. I should pretend like I'm really cooking here. Girl. <laughs> All right, y'all. So we got our jalapenos made. Okay, so. Oh, you you going you to you cook and you whip it? I mean, I'm gonna get out of the way. I'm right. just observing. You get down in the kitchen, so. What you need help with? Nothing. We're about to stuff these and add the bacon and stuff, and I'll put it in the um in the oven. Oh, okay. And then um, all right. So I'm gonna go ahead and start popping. I mean, adding this in, y'all. Oh, uh, they said happy early birthday. Y'all, mama's gonna be 62. On, Thank uh, you. It's my birthday. Mama's hey, gonna be 62. Mom is gonna be 62 on Tuesday. Tuesday. It's my birthday. I'm gonna party like it's my birthday. Hey, hey. hey. We want we want to get massages. Um it's gonna be in June because we were trying to go together and our our um therapist, the massage therapist, they um what are they are they called massage therapists? Masseuse? I think it's masseuse. I don't know. Masseuse. Anyway, Joseph for you, Amanda for me, we have to wait for a, um for them to be available. So it's gonna be in June. Right now, our, our appointment is, I think, June 10th. I think oh, so. So, anyways, y'all about to go ahead and put this in. This actually made a lot. These two chicken breasts made a lot. Just like that, y'all. Just add that in. Add as much as you want. So, I'm gonna go ahead and stuff these. Massage therapists. Okay, that's what they call massage therapists. Everybody saying hi, Auntie Nisi. Happy birthday. Thank you. I really appreciate all the love. I'm sorry. I appreciate the love. I'm sorry. Y'all. I'm excited about my birthday. You should be. And y'all, y'all already know that mom. So mom is having a customer appreciation sale right now, y'all. Her whole website is 40%. Is it 40% off? 40% off. 40% off. It's a customer appreciation because she just made four years for her business. Y'all know how hard it is to stay in business, okay? Mm -hmm. As a small business, it's hard to stay in business. You know what I'm saying? Like with so many ups and downs and stuff. But so mom just made four years, y'all. And her website is shirleygirlboutique.com if y'all want to check it out. Y'all don't need a code. You can just go on there, shop on, shop until you till you drop with your 40% off, okay? Right. Take advantage, you guys, if you're going to celebrate uh, Juneteenth is coming up. That's true. She got some African pieces. She got some African pieces there for you, 40% off. So take advantage. Take advantage. All right, y'all. So, so we still stepping. put those in. You want to help me with that? Mm -hmm. You could just sit and be okay. pretty. Let me just go step on the side then. You don't have to be on the side. You can be here with me. So y'all, I'm really like stuffing these, just so you see. Like I'm being real generous with this. Okay, so stuff, stuff until your heart is content. You gonna wrap those in bacon? Mm-hmm. Wrap them in bacon. Thank you for dropping the link. Chanel dropped the link. If anybody is interested in shopping. Thank you, Miss Chanel. I I might have some extra stuff left over. Which is cool because I still got some jalapenos too. Got some jalapenos left over as well. Are you gonna cook these? Huh? Can cook them? No, I'm actually gonna use a whole piece because like okay. these hopper, their jalapenos are so big. Okay. I'm gonna use a whole piece. This is so easy, mom. You wanna taste the filling? You wanna taste it? Yeah, okay, so let me get a uh my phone. It's good too. This is not, it's not it's not real spicy, right? No. Uh -uh. Okay. Hmm. That's good. 
Let's do it up. It's good and easy. Wow. It's, it's good, huh? I like it. It got like a nice little pop of flavor mm -hmm. from the um, the buffalo sauce. It's good. All right. I didn't even know that. Is it Sweet Baby Ray? Yeah. I didn't know he made a... Um... He got a couple different sauces. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. I'm almost done, y'all. Then we're going to get to the bacon. And what we're going to do, so we're going to pop these in the oven for, I'm going to say, like at least 15 minutes. And of course, everybody's oven is different. And you're going to want to, however you like your bacon. Some people like it cooked, you know, crispy. Some don't. So you just want to keep an eye on it. All right. Okay. I told y'all also, too, that I'm filming the chat. I got to get a reel out of this. I'm just doing a whole lot. You want to be my camera woman? Girl, I can't do the camera for myself. I'm just kidding. Okay. If you want a video, I can do that. Rhonda, you could just continue cooking and let me video. You yeah, are ready. Okay. What is this doing? I want to watch that. Hold on a second, y'all. What is going on? Oh, there we go. There we go. I hope everybody's having a good Sunday. I wish I could play some music. Maybe I will play some music. You don't have that uh, royalty free music? Yeah, but I don't want to hear that. You know, like I want to hear something like the good stuff. But don't you get penalized for it? Yeah, I do. That's why I'm not playing the music, which sucks. Like, you two need to get that together. Having a music is so much upbeat. Yeah, it adds a, um, a different element to things. Mm -hmm. It does. All right, y'all. I want to eat <laughs> one raw. It'll be like fresh veggie and dip right now. What's up, William? Did you put mozzarella in... Oh, no, 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 Ma no. There's no mozzarella in the filling at all. The filling is just chicken, cream cheese, and buffalo sauce. So the mozzarella will actually go on top for if you want that. If you want that, you can do that. So I'm going to do a couple like that. So let's go ahead and get to the baking, y'all. All right. So this is how we're going to do it, y'all. So can y'all see what I'm doing? wrap it around and boom and there we go y'all see that it's nice and snug in there okay what's up a lady b huh what pan are you gonna use you can put them all in at one time mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you could do and that's what i love about egg rolls too because you could do all kind of stuff all right so let's do that one more time y'all so i wrap mine around just three times you can cut your bacon in half if you want like if you don't want as much bacon you can do that um, I also got some bacon off to the side to where I also have bacon off to the side um, to where um, me, where you can also crumble bacon on top if you want. So that's what I'm going to do with a couple of them. I'm going to put some mozzarella cheese on top and let that brown in the oven. Oh, that's two pieces of bacon. Thank you. Thank you. This is great appetizer for a party. Yep. Yep. So, like, I think this is perfect because, like, the um, game come on tonight, the final game seven between the Heat and the Boston Celtics. So, we'll have these tonight. Ooh. This, this bacon is just, ah. okay, There we go. All right. So, we got that. Thank you. I think I'm going to do... Let's see. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. Should I do the rest? I'm going to do the rest with the crumbles. The crumbles. Mm -hmm. okay. I'm going to put mozzarella cheese, yeah. Okay. All right, y'all, so this is my last one that I'm wrapping in bacon. All right. And you want and the cheese? I mean, yeah. you know, like crumbles. The mozzarella cheese cake, I keep breaking the bowl. I'm going to make this for sure. Yes, please do. What's going on, Casey? Thank you guys for coming through and hanging out. Okay, so now... What I'm going to do is, for the ones that don't have bacon, I'm just going to top them with some mozzarella cheese. And you can add mozzarella to the ones that do have bacon. Whatever you want to do, just make it your own. Have fun with it. Did you want me to crumble this up for you? Bacon? Mm -hmm. No, not your uh, Well, you can. Okay. You can, or I could do it um, after when they come out the oven. Okay. 
No, we dress alike. I oh, see, we got on the side of pants. All right, y'all. So this is a close on the one that just has dip and just top of mozzarella cheese. What's up, Vaughn? What's going on? How you doing? I can't wait to see the outcome. Turkey bacon might not work for wrapping. It's not as flexible. I, th I don't even think I've ever tried turkey bacon, but I feel like that it wouldn't. I don't think I would like it. All right. So let's go ahead and get these in. Our right, what call it? My pink house that one over there. All right, so I'm going to put my bacon ones on here. You want to put the other ones on there, Mo? Okay. On that one? Okay. All right, so I'm putting these here on the cooking sheet. And like I said, I have my oven at 375. All right, so we got those ready to go in the oven. That's perfect. Mm -hmm. Move that to the side. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, shoot. Dang. What? What do you need? I forgot I need to record a reel. <laughs> Get your steps. <laughs> the things we do for social media. You want a pot holder? Oh, no. Mm -hmm. All right. Let me put this in there. Mm -hmm. I'll put it on there. All right. That's real. I'm, I'm worried about the bacon. I'm going to do the bacon right All right. So we got that in there. 15 minutes. Okay. Grab the rest of the cheese that fell off. I know, right? Um, I guess up to the get something go to the grocery. What's up, Kiara? Oh shoot. What's up, Miss Pooh Bear? You awesome. with that. What what? Thank you. Do you need this anymore? Mm -mm. Yes. Okay. Because I'm getting ready to make that. Okay. I'm going to wash my hands too. All right, so we're going to make the ranch now. Excuse me. Thank you. All right, so next up is the ranch. If y'all missed it, y'all, this, this is how the ranch is going to look. And I will tell you that it is best, I would say, for you to chill your ranch for two to four hours. So this is ranch that I made on Friday. Y'all can see that. Hopefully, you can see it. So, you can see how it's going to turn out. Got a nice little jiggle and consistency to it. All right. Let me take a little piece of bacon. Put it in my ranch. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Hey, good. Yeah. All right. So what do you want me to do? Mm. Hmm? What do you need me to do? I'm going to cut up my herbs. Okay. All right, y'all, I'm going to cut some herbs up. I got some Italian parsley here. What nice piece like you use? This one? Mm-mm. The longest one. Okay. You want me to put paste some water in here? No, sir. Can you put that over there, brother? She got the, um, here we go. Actually, y'all, let me go ahead and put in the base of it. All right, so we're going to be using sour cream, mayo, and Greek yogurt. All right, so let me actually do this first. What do you want? Can see? Sorry. Is the ranch keto friendly? The ranch is keto friendly. 
If you put buttermilk in it, it won't be keto um, because buttermilk does have some sugar in it, if I'm not mistaken. Or it's the carbs. Or the, it's something in it that makes it not keto. That's why I'm using Greek yogurt instead of buttermilk. But you can use buttermilk if you want to. So we're going to start off with two tablespoons of mayo. We're going to do two tablespoons of mayo. I need a half a cup of sour cream. So two tablespoons of mayo. Oh, sorry, this is in the way, y'all. My bad. Thank you. I'm gonna do. What's going on? What does something happen? Um, what, what is it? Half a cup of mayo? No, I mean, half a cup of sour, sour cream. Half a cup of sour cream. So half a cup of sour cream. So two tablespoons of mayo, half a cup of sour cream, and I'm about to do a half a cup of Greek yogurt. Now you can do buttermilk instead if you want, but that will keep this from being keto at that point. And I don't think that it's so far out of keto, but I wanted to make a keto ranch instead. And half of a lemon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Squeeze in half a lemon. This is this is a big lemon. All right, so half of a lemon. Also, too, y'all. I'm look. I like that. There's a tanginess that I like in ranch. So I'm gonna put in two drops of this Worcestershire sauce. Okay, God, because you don't want to put in too much. You know what I'm saying? So, two drops. There we go, I got my two drops. Um, hey Rhonda, I'm upset to get the grocery store. This will be, yeah, I'm gonna leave it up, uh-huh. I'm gonna leave everything up. And also in the description, I'm gonna put the recipe as well, the measurements and stuff too. Um, so I need, um, let me do a, let me pass me the book mom. I'm about to add in a tablespoon of milk. Now, the reason why I'm adding milk in, milk in is so that it kind of like thins it out a little bit for me. So I'm going to add a tablespoon of milk. Thank you, Ma. Got my lemon, got my milk. I need to, let me, I'm going to cut the herbs up real quick. So I need to do a tablespoon of each. So I'm doing a tablespoon of each herb. It's going to be a tablespoon of parsley, chives, and and dill. Y'all, I love chopping. I don't know why. Like, if I ever come to your house and we hang out, you can put me on veggies. I love cutting vegetables up. That's why I love you for uh, Thanksgiving. That's why, that's why I moved back in the house, y'all, so I can cut the vegetables up for my parents. <laughs> that's why I'm here, y'all. That's, ah! that's, that's how I got here, y'all. That's what I. This is what I'm here for, to cut up veggies. That's what I do. Because that's what I love to do. Like when we, It don't matter if we're having tacos or whatever. It's almond milk, lactate, okay. Yes, uh-huh. Because that's what I'm sorry. I actually use almond milk. I'm sorry. So use whatever kind of milk you like. I don't think that it changes or throws off the flavor at all. So lactate, regular milk, 2%, doesn't matter. All right. So my parsley is in. I'm about to cut up my chives. Yes, me too. I love to prep and cut things. Mm -hmm. You said a word on the Sunday. Oh, oh okay. Y'all in here, what y'all talking about? I missed something. 
All right, so I'm cutting up chives. So again, y'all, I'm doing like about a tablespoon of the herbs, dill, parsley, chives. I even saw some recipes too. People use cilantro. So I think, so I'll tell you this about this recipe too, is that it needs to chill for two to four hours and you kind of taste everything and you probably will make, want to make some adjustments. Like once I tasted the ranch after, I actually let it sit to the next day and I tasted how everything was and I made some adjustments at that time. Um, I wanted to add more salt, but then I tasted it with a Lay's potato chip and the Lay's actually gave me the salt that I would have put in the, the dressing. You know what I'm saying? So just be mindful of that. You know, so this is, this is just the foundation of a recipe. You can still make your adjustments in terms of like seasoning and stuff like that. Um, and now let me go ahead and add in some dill. Damn, I should have bought some more dill. I didn't realize I had used as much. No, I'll just have the season lined up for you. Oh, thank you. I don't even have a lot of deal, y'all, but that's fine. It'll be enough. That, to me, deal is kind of strong, so. All right, y'all. Get my deal. You can get a little more for you. Yeah, no, that's fine. It's okay. All right, so now it's time for the seasoning, y'all. So I'm putting in six different seasonings. Okay, so everything that I'm about to put in right now is gonna be half a teaspoon, y'all. We're gonna do a half a teaspoon of every single thing that you see right now. So I'm putting in half a teaspoon of Italian seasoning. I'm gonna put in half a teaspoon of onion powder and garlic powder. Half a teaspoon of onion powder and garlic powder. Thank you, Mom. Oh, oh, my bad. Okay, what the time goes? Oh, wait, what the other time for this? I'll put them together. Thank you. Can you pass me the salt? No, I'm going by it. The way you know, I know, but I'm, I'm using these last. Um, okay. I'm going to put in some a half a teaspoon of salt. And then, hey Carla, you love dill? Y'all, you already know I'm using my seasoning. We, we putting the all purpose, y'all, and we also doing the jalapeno garlic pepper. All right, so y'all, y'all know I'm restocked. And because y'all are on the live, I actually put the website on sale for y'all, okay? So the website is on sale right now, all seasonings. I think I have four Cajun lemon pepper left. They're $9.99 right now instead of $12.99. So goodestcanbe.co. If somebody can put the link in the, uh, the chat for me. So, half a teaspoon of all purpose, half a teaspoon of jalapeno garlic pepper. Thank you. You get a whisk. Thank you, Mom, for your help. You're welcome. I appreciate it. All right, y'all. So, we got everything in there. Did we get everything? Yep. Yeah. Worcestershire lemon, milk, chives, yogurt, blah, 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 blah. Yep. Did you right. get, uh, yeah, do you have all purpose? Yeah, I put that hurt too. Okay. Rhonda, we're just talking positively and complimenting. Oh, okay, okay. I got my super excited about it. Y'all look at that house coming along. All right, so our pop is still cooking. All right, whisking that along. I love the consistency of this already. Can y'all see that? And boom, our ranch is done. That's it. So you got to let this chill for two hours. You gonna let that chill for two hours. I would say at least two hours. You could do it overnight. You could do two to four hours. I would say at least two hours though. At least two hours.
Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, all right, cool. So that's it, y'all. We're just waiting for the poppers to get done. And then we can taste everything. Because I got my ranch that I made the other day right here, ready to go. I'm going to put this in a container, bro. Okay. Oh, man. Dang, I like the way it turned out. It is good. Mm -hmm. Let me taste it a little bit. Get back to the spoon bar. Mm. Damn, that was good. That's even better than the other day. That's up. Mm -hmm. Damn, that tastes good. Mm. Damn, that's good, huh? Mm. Ooh, that's good. Look at that deal popping. Damn, y'all. This tastes, that ranch tastes better than this. Honestly. It does. What was different? I don't know. Was it more lemon juice? That lemon that I squeezed in there was way bigger than the one that I had the last time. Um, that, that lemon, that half a lemon was the size of, that was, it wasn't, it was more lemon. That was the difference. Mm. It's, a, it's a very good flavor. Damn, that's good. I hope y'all make this ranch. It's delicious. I'm going to try it. What? I'm gonna make it better than you. What? Now you wanna have a ranch cook off? Yes. Girl. <laughs> Mama, that's not fair. You already do so many other things better than me. So <laughs> let me you. have something. What's up, Angel? Girl, you know I'm not gonna make that ranch. What'd you say? You know I ain't gonna make that ranch. Y'all, the ranch is bomb. What's up, just me? What if my stomach is touching my back? And the way my bank account is set up, I ain't got two hours. You could just go ahead and eat it now because it actually tastes really good right now. You could, but I mean, it's going to taste even better once the flavor settles in. And here I am worried about Wingstar Ranch, where I'm giving out free game. <laughs> Do the cook-off. Mom, what you, what, what you want to cook off together? I'm not going to cook anything. It's not the, It's not November. Girl, y'all, she ain't cooking until November. Okay. I ain't getting no food. This is, this is too cool, girl. Mom did cook when I was sick. I had to be sick, though. Well, you had to eat. All right, but that's... All right. All right, so our... Listen, that's been in there for... It's been almost 15 minutes. It's going to have to stay in there for a little longer. Um, Happy Sunday to you. What's up? What's going on? How you doing? Good as can be sale right now for $9.99. Get your season today. They're amazing. Thank you. Oh, look at you sounding like a good as can be spokesperson. Thank you. That's so sweet. That's awesome. I want some more of that uh, filling. Uh, I, can't, I cannot wait to try this. You talking about the buffalo filling? Yeah. What you want me to do it? I don't know. I'm going to leave it. What did I need it? Man, that fresh came off so damn. Yeah. I put them there. What? Are you going to get them there? Yeah, I'm going to put it in the refrigerator. Oh. To let it sit that long until that thing is What's wrong? My phone just started. Okay. <laughs> that is so good. Mm. Thank you, my dear. Mm -hmm. Damn, that's good. Mm. Y'all, I can't believe how good this ranch is. I cannot believe how good this ranch is. Yeah, mama's giving, baby. I only see auntie's arm. Hi, auntie. <laughs> I can't. Wow. That's crazy how that lemon tastes. You know what I think is a difference, too? Is that when I made the ranch the first time, right? I let it sit overnight, then I added in some additional seasoning, so I made my adjustments. And maybe putting every all the seasoning in now, in the beginning, also made a difference, too. You know what I'm saying? Because like I seasoned it a certain way the day before, and then added stuff in later. So this is, this is good. This is good. But the way that I made it today is great. I hope all is well. Just getting home from work. What's up, Teresa? What's up, Harrigans? What's going on? How you doing? Good to see you. Hey, Sean. I miss you so very much. What's good? It's good to see you. I miss you, too. I miss you, too. Happy Sunday, everybody. Happy Sunday. I'm going to see. Can I pin? Let's see. Hi, Sheena. From the UK. Oh, nice. That is nice. Uh-oh. Wait, hold on. <coughs> <coughs> Check some water. Mm, yeah. 
Oh, I can't pin. You can't pin. I can't pin the um the thing. Happy Sunday from the UK. I love to cook. Just see people happy. Me too. Mm -hmm. Rhonda wanna uh Rhonda wanna pin the comment with the discount and the link. It won't let me. Am I tripping? Do I have to put a star next to it? What do I gotta do? You want your phone? Huh? No, I don't think I need that. Hold on. If I add a star, what happens? Oh, there we go. Okay. Boom. I pinned Oli's message. Thank you, Oli. Hey, Oli. Oh, she just said hi to you, too, when you went outside. Honey, lemon tea, Rhonda, and water. No, I have something, like, stuck in my throat. Like, maybe, like, so, I don't know. They they kinda, <laughs> it might have been, a, I don't know, it might have been a deal. Um, I love to see people happy and eat my food holidays. I kill it. What's your, so what's your signature dish that you guys make on the holidays? What is your signature dish? Like something that can't nobody touch you. Like you are untouchable with this dish. I don't think I have an untouchable dish yet. I don't even trust myself to cook for the holidays. And I know you I need have to cook for the holidays. I have, but I don't think that I have like a signature hot like holiday dish though. I don't think I do. Harrigan said mac and cheese. Ain't nobody touching my mac and cheese. I really don't get to see your lives that much, but when I do, ooh wee. Hi, Linda. I'm glad that you're here. My bay goods, you are sounding much better, Rhonda. Thank you. I feel a lot better, y'all. And maybe the tequila helped with that. Girl. The tequila could have helped with that, y'all, because, like, tequila whooped my ass last night. But I do feel, I mean, I felt like shit this morning. But my cold, the congestion is better. So I think the tequila might have helped with that. Uh, okay. Angel said my ham and my turkey. Yay. Mm, okay. Wait, ma'am, step back, because that waist looks slim. It's, you know, look, okay, let me step back for y'all a little bit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Girl, you're just doing extra. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, can't nobody touch me with the greens, cornbread, and potato salad. I can make all the greens, honey baked ham, all the baked goods. I can cook anything. Damn, I need to come to y'all house. Okay, I need to come. To I love your cooking, mama. I'm not saying that. That's not what I'm saying. Oh, I'm not offended by anything. Mama. I'm just saying, I'm trying to come. Like, I wish we all live close to each other so I can come by and get a plate. This is what I'm saying. Mm. So, yes, ma'am. Hey, Tamika, the tequila is knocking it out. I make a good Spanish pino. Oh, a Spanish pork. It's one thing about the holidays is that a person that, you know, like a family member or friend that you haven't really tried their, that dish. Yeah, you can't be trying you stuff. Don't be trying it. No, you definitely can't be trying stuff on Thanksgiving. Don't be doing that, y'all. Well, we know better than that. We know. We know. We're not going to be trying no shit on Thanksgiving. No, but people do try, though. No, yeah, they do. And you know, you shouldn't try that. All right, this looks... Done, I think it's possible. Awesome. Bacon's taking a long time to cook. Yeah, he's so done. Huh? Tanita, what kind of way they brown a little bit though? Okay. What you think? I'm gonna let it brown a little bit. Come on, bacon. That's it. It ain't. Look, it's gonna take a while to cook. Y'all, and we don't have a broiler. We just have a brown. I know. Y'all, the bacon is taking a while. So bear with me. I just started cooking Thanksgiving, so I'm still learning. Me too, Rose. How you doing? It's good to see you. I don't. I don't think I. I wouldn't feel comfortable. I like being the sous chef for Thanksgiving. What's your favorite Thanksgiving dish? Mine is. Damn, that's hard. Greens. Yours is greens. No, I'm, I'm, oh no, greens is one of my favorite. It's a tie prop. It's a honestly. Mm, I can't choose. Now, one of the things that I said that I don't cook well for Thanksgiving are the. Oh, uh, mom can't. Not that you can't make hams, but you make sweet. I mean, you make the sweet potato feeling so good. I mean, I, I mean, I know that that's a little bit different, right? Yeah, it does. I mean, I, and I do that and do a for me mm. for the sweet potato pie. Mm. But I don't like to make my yams come out. Thanks for the discount. I just placed my second order since the restock this month. Oh, thank you so much for supporting me. I appreciate y'all. Thank you guys so much. I think about how. Um, how just grateful I am, you know, like I, there's no way that I could do these restocks and even just stay in business without y'all. You know what I mean? Like, thank you guys for, I really created it because of, because of y'all, believe it or not. Um, I literally, I never wanted a seasoning company, but when I started doing the recipes and people started asking for modifications and making stuff, um, friendly for their, you know, whether it was a health ailment or a dietary restrictions, some type of need, that's what made me create it. You know what I mean? There, I saw that there was like a demand for it. Yeah. And I'm just really grateful that I can have this company, that I can create recipes and just happy to still be around. Good as can be will be two years in October. 
So, and, and I've been able to get to that place because of y'all. So thank you so much. Do you put your bacon in the oven? Because let me tell you, it's better in the oven. I don't, but I know that it is good in the oven though. You love yams? Oh, I never even, and let me answer the question. My favorite thing, the things that I have to have on my plate is four things, y'all. I got to have macaroni, dressing, fried corn. My mama's fried corn is bomb. And did I say macaroni and cheese? No. Yes, macaroni and cheese. Macaroni and cheese, dressing, greens, and fried corn. If I can only have those four things, I will be content. Drop the link to the website. Oh, okay. I'll drop it again. I think I also pinned it too at the top, y'all. But here's the link. You don't have to put in uh, a code or anything. I just put it on, on sale. And I wanted to do that because I appreciate y'all being here. I haven't cooked in a long time. So I was like, that's so sweet of you. Yeah. And the free said, I'm sorry, but since I don't have my mom anymore, I'm taking yours. Okay, we can share. I am available. <laughs> you available? I'm available. <laughs> mom says she's available. Um, how, love. you mean how long have I been cooking? And look, y'all, I I don't know how I started cooking so well. This is a new thing. I'm not really a cook like that, you know. I think when you were watching the the, uh, the cooking shows before you started. Well, yeah, I've been watching cooking shows my whole life. Oh, maybe you meant okay. So I've been cooking. I used to only cook well enough to feed myself, y'all. Okay. <laughs> no, seriously, I used to only do enough to send. I mean, to cook me like I couldn't. My stuff will be dry, oily, under seasoned, you name it. Like my dad used to hate my food. Okay. He'd be like, damn, dry. Dry as hell. And he he did not bite his tongue. Okay. My dad be like, this food is dry. Okay. So I don't know. I just got better. I got better at it. And I feel like what it was, why why I got better at cooking is because I took the pressure off myself about it. That was the thing. I allowed myself to be creative in the kitchen. Um, I didn't feel like I needed to cook as good as anybody else or I had to master anything. And I think that that's what made me better. I love your mom so much. Cake, ooh, cake cornbread will send you on. Two years, I remember when you just dropped it. That's crazy. This is your baby. It sure is. Oh, how long have I been cooking? You literally wanted to know how long I've been in here cooking. My bad. <laughs> I don't want okay. on, on a whole tangent. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. This is Rhonda. Listen. I'm sorry. I, am not, I didn't know what the question meant. I took it out of context. We've been on here for 53 minutes, and we're waiting for the poppers to come out of the oven. Um, uh, Oli says, Auntie, you taking applications? You want some more kids? Girl, applications are open. She, you see how she didn't consult with me? Ain't asked me nothing. I have to ask you. What? I'm available. Available to do what? To be a, a lovely mom. You, have to sh you can share me. No. I'm just kidding. No, I'll, I'll share my mom with y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Why your mom be hollering like this? <laughs> Mama, you be hollering. Hollering. I'm so glad that you're willing to share with me. I need mama right now to tell me hugs are better than money. Yes, they are. Mm -hmm, they are. So much, right? Oh, wait. Savannah said, I'm here. Where can we apply? Okay, just uh, hit me up. You know what? You know what? <laughs> you send your name? Of course. In fact, let's just, let's just make this simple. <laughs> what? Follow me at Shirley Girl Boutique on Instagram. DM me. Oh, so you take the DM request? That's, that's fine. The kids? Girl, the is falling apart, okay? All of them? No, well, that's all right. Damn. They're looking good, though. It's going to be good, for sure. I probably should have put a, um, some toothpicks in there. That's fine. So do you, are you going to crumble the, the bacon for the other one? Mm-hmm. Hold on. I'm going to throw it out. Oh, see, it's starting to brown. Yeah, one more minute. All right, y'all still with me? I can't even. I don't have my glasses. Oh, you can't see? You read the comments? I mean, I can see, but I can't read the comments. <laughs> so they could be talking about you, dogging you. You wouldn't even know. It. All right, that's okay. It's, that's all good. I just love you, I love you. I need to order. Hey, Lily. Why are you crazy? No, that's you. Mom's hair is always be late. Thank you. This this is my self care, y'all. She been what she been she been going to get your hair done. How long you been going to Kelvin? Twenty two years. For real? Mm -hmm. Wow. So I was a teenager. Mm -hmm. For real. I was so glad when I found Kelvin because I used to. I've always got my hair done, but I used to sit in anybody's chair, and I just wanted something different. I never really wore my hair short. I mean, I did once, but it was just like because I, I sat in somebody's chair and they just they did me wrong. 
So it was one of my customers, one of my banking customers, referred me to Kelvin at Who Does Your Hair, and it's been it's been a great ride ever since. Love, I love Mexican food. Mexican food is my favorite. Is my favorite food. Mm -hmm. Dash said we look like twins. Hmm? You think that we look like mom? Who dad? No, me and you. Let's see. Dash, Dash, Dash said that we look like twins. You think we look like? No, just smile, regular smile, mom. Y'all think we look like? Cheese, cheese. This is my girl, y'all. This is my ride or die. I am Lucy, and you are Ethel, and which we means that we be getting in trouble, and it's usually her fault, <laughs> y'all. The adventures, it's always her. It ain't never me. It has, is it ever me, mom? Do I ever start it? No. She no. just be pulling me in her in her shit, y'all. Basically, we're partners in crime. Cause she pulled me in, and I don't have no choice. <laughs> you can say no now, but back in the day, oh yeah, my partner in crime. Y'all, I used to be like, oh, my daddy is gonna kill us. <laughs> that's that's this was this would be. I'm like, oh god. Uh, ah! Oh my daddy is gonna kill us. I love I love Lucy. Me too. Yeah. Yeah, we 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 are we are we are ride or die. We right crazy. Now. We done did some crazy stuff, y'all. <laughs> and I know I done told y'all this story time before, but y'all, this one time before they changed the um, you know, the car washes, like the ones at the gas station. <laughs> before they changed it, y'all, they used to. Do y'all remember when the car wash used to be where you had to put your car on the tracks <laughs> to go through the car wash? Do y'all remember that? So that's how it used to be out here. Is that you used to have to put your car on the, the tracks? Track, yeah in order to go through, right? And so me and my mom decide like, oh, let's just go to the drive through I don't know why we just didn't go to the hand car wash, right? We couldn't put the car on the tracks. It wouldn't go on the tracks, right? So we trying to call the people. They're like, well, we can't come out because he was like, oh, I'm, we understand. I'm here by myself. I can't help you, you know, whatever. So it's a long ass line behind us. We came back up, right? People honking at us and everything, right? So my mama gonna say, just drive through, Rhonda. I'm like, mama, we can't just go through because it's, it's a track, you know? Y'all, we just, I just, I just, I just, I just punch it straight through the thing. We done heard all kinds of stuff. We think the windows done shattered, like everything, <laughs> right? It was crazy. We just fly through the drive through real quick. And all you hear, all you hear is all this stuff, right? So we, we both ducking and I'm driving through. <laughs> Y'all, I'm like, mama, why you had me do that? She like, just drive through. She was like, if your windows get busted, we'll just go get them fixed tomorrow. Like that ain't that big of a deal. Like that ain't expensive. I'm like, girl, <laughs> that was crazy, y'all. That was a crazy. I think but why? Why was I ducking though? I was ducking because I was scared. <laughs> oh my god! So thank God that I remember. Like I was like traumatized from that, so I stopped going through the drive through car wash, and then I realized they fixed it where you could just drive through on your own, which oh, was great. Oh, that's what they do now. Mom, you thought they still had the tracks? Girl, no, no, no. Oh. So you drive in now, and it tells you it goes. Eh, it tells you when to stop, and that's it. Okay. So you just drive through regular. Oh, okay. And then once it's done, like wiping and you know cleaning, there's a green thing that comes on to tell you to to go. Oh, okay. It's definitely been longer than 15 minutes on the oven. Y'all thought it was gonna be. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go what has it been? It's been. It's been like what about 25 minutes? Let's see. Probably y'all think though. Thank you. Don't pull it up. Pull it up. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Let me get. You gonna take them over there? Hold on. Let me get another one. Okay. What's that going on? Oh, sorry. I told you. Here go our cheese, ones, y'all. I mean, yeah, the ones top of mozzarella. It still got tracks in Ohio. We have workers who tell us how to. <laughs> so we went along. Are you serious? What tip do you have the bacon on? I have it on 375. Because the last every time I make a 375, it's perfect. Mr. Crumbling? You can hand me. I can do it over here. I'm still crumbling right on top. Okay. You want to have one? Yeah, I have one. You need that for that. All right, y'all. So I'm just gonna crumble some bacon. Yo, I am weak. About <laughs> they still got it in the paper. The people tell you how to align. Oh my god. Did you ever tell me the story time about your car 
you first started driving. The day I got in an accident? The first day? Yeah, with your car. Probably. I think I did. I'm laughing at me and I'm laughing at your dad. He was pissed. Because, first of all, you know, uh, let's put the car on the, uh, let's park it on the street. I was like, he's going to be suspicious. Mm-hmm. He saw this when she came home. He came home. Your name? What happened to Ron's car? I was like, you can ask her. Mm. I'm like, we in this together, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Me and you will never part. Who else have that kind of relationship with their mom? Or partners in crime. What the oil is that? Alright, so I just put the bacon on top. Mm. Be careful. I forgot I really was about to pick that up. Bacon on top, y'all. So you can do it that way. And apparently that's the quicker way. <laughs> <laughs> So we're going to try these out in a second. There's still some in L.A. too. They got them in L.A., Mom. They do? Mm-hmm. You want to go find one? For old times, like, you want to do that? Let's do it. <laughs> yeah, right. My car is open now, so I can use my car. You want to try it? Girl, why she want <laughs> Why does she want to try this? My car needs to be washed, though. Wait, the, y'all got the tracks in Vegas? Mm-mm. Really? Yes. Oh, wow. I always have to snack on the bacon a little bit. You got to. Okay. Jesus, we got to let them sit for a second. It's hot. You want to eat it like that? Because this way, if you eat it this time, you're going to be eating it. You already know. It's going to be like, I'm not going to do all that. But, uh, I hate when I got to eat food like that. You want to, you want to, here, you can put yours on the same plate. That's fine. Here. Excuse me. I'm sorry. I have the, that relationship with my mom. She's the best. Oh, that's sweet. I'm so happy about the way that ranch turned out. As he said, it was always me and my dad after some shenanigans. <laughs> I'm surprised. Have we ever been in a situation where we almost ended up in jail? No. Mm-hmm. No, that's one thing. We wouldn't, it wasn't going to ever happen. Mm-mm. But imagine if we were. Hey, Regina. If we were what? If we were put in jail. Who's going to come get us? Your dad would have to give us, I don't know how many. Mm. That would give us hell if we gave it. You got to collect cards. <laughs> jail? For us, for what did you call pissed. me for, right? <laughs> you think daddy believed us in jail? <laughs> I think he would come get us. Now, he might let us sit there for a minute. My daughter has that with me. I'm thankful she's yelling at the screen, at the screen like, Mom, I ain't driving through no car wash, messing up my car. <laughs> 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 they still got the tracks in Philly. I thought it was really? going everywhere. What's up, JoJo? What you think you would go to jail for? Mm. What would I go? To, what would you go to jail for? Spending too much money, girl. <laughs> no, I don't know. Like a for real offense. I, I guess. Um, I probably if I ever went to jail, it probably would be assault on somebody else. But trying to defend myself or my family, I feel like that's what I can go to jail for, probably. I don't know. But I, I'm never going to jail though, y'all, because I can't do jail. But I feel like if I if, if I have to tell you something that I might go to jail for, it would be probably assault. But again, defending myself. And then, and by the time they get the story straightened out, I feel like it'll just be self defense, and they will let me out. But mm. I can only imagine Uncle getting that call. <laughs> I'm gonna have to replay this to get that ranch recipe. Yes, and I'm gonna also put it in the description too. So I'm gonna leave this live up. I'm gonna put everything in the description so you know exactly what to do whenever you go back and um and watch it. Time to dig in. <laughs> I wanna see that cross section. Let's see that cross section. Yeah. So you think it's um? Uh, oh, it's probably cool enough now.
Are you ready? I'm ready. Let me get this out the way. Can you pass me a thing? You put it on something? I put it to 400. 400? I don't know what's going on today, y'all. Again, I don't know if it's the bacon or the oven or combination of both. All right. So just adjust your oven accordingly, y'all. But again, usually 375, 15 to 20 minutes usually will cook my bacon. Whenever I've done it before, but today, today is a different day. You you live today. Right now it's like, let me act up. So here we go. This one has the um the buffalo chicken in it, top of mozzarella cheese, top of some crumbled bacon. Mm, mm, mm. Look what happened. She done drop her whole thing in there. Because it's hot. Mmm. 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 Got good meal. Mmm. 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 Y'all. Please. This is so good. Please. Okay. I beg of thee. Make this. Oh, this is so good. Mmm. 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 Oh, I like that. I could pop mine. With the ranch. Mm. Mm -hmm. Y'all. I have so many things that I like in rotation that you make. This is to make the list. Mm. She just said, I love the consistency of the ranch. Me too. Mm -hmm. Believe it or not, <clears throat> that little bit of milk helped with the consistency. Mmm. Wow. Woo! That's good. Y'all. Mmm. I'm not having another one. Back one. Where that? Oh, you put them on the side. Oh, girl, I didn't put them over here. No, where that? Where that? Where that? Where that? You guys let us know how you, yours turn out when you make it. Shit, that's hot too. Mmm. Woo, y'all. What y'all cooking for tomorrow? What that? Is Daddy grilling? What did we have like with Holly? No, um, he told me it's a surprise. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> That's what he said. What? He said, don't worry about it. It's a surprise. <sighs> mm. Same stuff for your dad. You think he gonna like this? We gonna it's, it's gonna be something for him. He ain't like this. Huh? He ain't into this I'm telling y'all, my dad don't be eating the stuff I be cooking. I don't know why. I'm why daddy don't be eating my food. I mean, I just kind of, no, I, was, I was basic too. Until you start cooking the way you start cooking, then I started doing the trying other things. He don't try a lot of stuff. He be missing out, okay? He eats some stuff. He eats some of it, not all of it. I think that he might like this because it's chicken. Mm. Yeah. Mm. That's the way you, you know, you start making kale. Mm -hmm. He didn't like it at first. He didn't. He like it now. Mm -hmm. She asked me the other day, you gonna make some kale? I was like, well, what's gonna go with it? Mm -hmm. Dad said he said, why not the oven? Dad's about to try the poppers. Sound like he's busting, busting. You said, mm hmm, this thing is looking good. It is. He on the live. No. Oh. <laughs> it was somebody said. Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay. Mm. This is so good. Huh. Mm. It's clearing my this clearing my nose out too, I'll tell you that. Mm -hmm. It's not hot, but you know it's still got a little bit of the heat just from the jalapeno. But <clears throat> I'm say say the healthy mess. For real. He's not mm -hmm. here for the health. Mm. Okay. I'm just gonna make room so that I can put the other one over here. Man, y'all ain't gonna like how they look. Y'all, they start busting and everything. I can't. Hold on, hold on. Still gonna get eight though. I'm gonna put them right there. One second. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is my water? Yes, I opened you. it for you. <sighs> mm. Woo. Hi, Cheryl. Hi, everybody that's in here. Mm, mm, mm. <sighs> this was good. 
All right, y'all. So they didn't want to be on their best behavior today. That's fine. Things, things sometimes don't go as planned. Huh? You don't want to put them in another period. You want to just serve them like she was pregnant. That's how they look. I know. Mm-hmm. This is, that, that's a good presentation for you. I mean, it's fine. It already, they already they look. This, this is how they turned out, y'all. You want to, you want to, uh, what the hell? Girl, they done felt. We should have. I should have used two picks. You know what? Too the jalapenos have almost. I've never cooked with jalapenos this big. They kind of big. Like the other ones were a lot smaller. But this is the turnout, which is fine. I'm okay with this. See that? Still gonna be good. I'm about to, I can't wait till this cool off a little bit. Hi, Darlene. It's okay, Twinkie. That's actually my name. Buffalo chicken, honey, peanut peppers. I know it's good. Yes, I can't wait. I can't wait to try them. The bacon smells good. Mmm. Mmm. That bacon is crispy at the bottom. Mmm. Mmm. Yes. I'm so happy how that ranch turned out. I cannot believe how much different it tastes in the one for me the day. And it's the exact same ingredients. I think uh, definitely the lemon was bigger though. Lemon was bigger. And I was telling them too, I wonder if it made a difference because like how the seasoning settled the night before. And then I added more in later. I don't know if that made it. That that's the only difference is that I did make the adjustment to the season the next day. Dash said it's good. Ooh, yes, yes, yes. It still looks really good. I'm making bacon right now. Is that bacon have mercy on my waistline? Mm. I've been told to try pre cook the bacon a little first so it finishes in the oven. You know what's so funny? I was just talking about that yesterday. Like, oh, you know what? I might kind of hit the bacon a little bit on both sides and then wrap it. Mm-hmm. Well, that's for next time. Yeah, it's still gonna get eight, so it don't matter. Mm, I can't wait. These are great appetizers for parties. Mm-hmm. That filling is so good. It's so simple. It's good though. Mm-hmm. I like this good. Monkey passing plate. Yeah, I really want to have one. No, that one, no. You give me that one. This one here? Huh? This one right here. Mm. Thank you. She passed me the um, scratch one. Thank you. All right. I'm eyeballing. Here we go. Here we go. Here we got this one. This is the one I'm going to go for, y'all. Oh, shit. I got grease on the computer. Mm-mm. That's all right. Easy fix. Okay. Here we go. This one I'm going for. Y'all see that? Um, you can always, I know, I should have used two picks, especially with these big jalapenos, because the jalapenos was never this big on the ones I made in the past either. Mm mm. Mm. That bacon is bomb in the oven. Like that. Mm, adult jungle juice. Made some s'mores. I'm tired and feel poop. Oh, y'all went in. Damn, we had rib tip, chicken, pork chops, hot links, hot dogs, rice, beef, burgers, chicken burger, potato salad, macaroni salad, pasta salad, macaroni. What house is that at? Okay. <laughs> she loves. What is it? Right. Where y'all live? Can we come over? <laughs> Can we come get a plate? Well, I bring something. I'll bring whatever you want me to bring. My can you pass me my spoon? I don't know if I'm lying up. You just rest it. Can you rest it for me? Girl, we got all kinds of dishes over here. Thanks, I was not caring. <laughs> so he passed me my phone. I'm told, I'm probably vlogging too. Lord Jesus. <laughs> I just, girl. <laughs> I'm vlogging. I'm, y'all want to say, I'm going to say hi to y'all in the, <clears throat> the thing. I'm checking in on the live, y'all. Hello to everybody, to all the good people that are in here. I appreciate y'all for being in here. Some people are actually cooking along. Some people are going to come back and cook later. So I'm checking in, um, y'all. The ranch turned out so good. Me and mom over here tearing it up. I'm about to get ready to try uh, one of the bacon wrap jalapeno poppers because I also made a couple that just had um, 
bacon on top, and I put some mozzarella cheese on those. Delicious, y'all. What do you think, Mama? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna try this bacon one right now. You finna try it right now? Mm-hmm. Dash, that is so good. Ooh, that was a good bite. It's still it's hot, huh? Mmm. Mmm. Mm, 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 that mm. bacon is good, huh? Mm. Um. So yeah, y'all. Mm. So I want to check in real quick. Um. Let's see. I've been on live for about an hour and sixteen minutes, and it's one good. We having a good time just hanging out. I'm gonna slap your mama. <clears throat> I'm gonna slap my mama. <laughs> 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 Is that good? <laughs> for real? My mama said it's so good that she want to slap my mama. Delicious. Hey, hey. A plus. A plus, plus, plus. plus. <laughs> Wait. Dad said damn near burnt my mouth, but it was worth it. Okay. Now let me go ahead for my, my dip. Put my ranch in there. Dad, she made the ranch too? Mmm. 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 Mm. I know I should have waited. Mm. Mm. So good. I'm sorry. Mm, mm, mm. Y'all. Mm. Please, I'm gonna put the I'm gonna put the ranch recipe in the description on this on this video too. Y'all, this ranch is good as hell. Please make it. And also you should make the poppers too, but at least make the ranch. At least do that for real. You will not be disappointed. Wait, <clears throat> Dad said you got rent. You got Wingstop beat on a rent for real. What? No. What? That's how you feel? Hey. Hmm. That's a very mm-hmm. good compliment. Cause I like ranch. That's an here. amazing uh, compliment. Yeah, but I think they have pretty good ranch at Wingstop. Hmm. My God. Mm. Thank you, Marta. Wow. Mm. So, because I got to make it down, I'm going to try some bell pepper. Ooh, poppers. I definitely need that ranch. Mm. The ranch is good. I might even go lie. Y'all looking good. The born a winner. Thank you. It's good to see you. It's good to see you. I'm gonna drink some water, y'all. Too bad I can't drink no tequila. What did you say? You want some tequila? Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even talk right now. My mouth is but is <laughs> about the buzz chewing. That's so dope. I'm glad that you made it. I'm glad that you enjoyed it. Y'all, thank y'all for being in here and coming and cooking along with me. I'm definitely gonna leave this recipe up. Check the description box for all the um the ingredients. I want I will put everything in there. I'm making these for dinner appetizers. Otherwise, dinner is smothered chicken, rice, and green beans. That sounds good. Oh, oh, this is for me. Mm-hmm. I gave you another one. Did you have another one? Why you don't want it? You don't want to? Not right now. Mm, you full? Mm. Let's have one. Let's have one more, y'all. Put a, put a row. <laughs> put a row. <laughs> Hit one. <laughs> Is that what you said last night for the tequila? One for the road, girl. Yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. Are you satisfied? Extremely. When they came out, like, yeah. Mm-hmm. She was very proud. They came out really nice. Mm. You can see the comments. Yes, please give the live a thumbs up if you haven't done so already, y'all. Mm. No, but they're really good. They're really good. When they make theirs too, they'll be seeing that too because it's a lot of flavor. A lot of good flavor. So, Aries, you can do it with 
You can make it with two tablespoons of mayo, half a cup of sour cream, and half a cup of buttermilk. And then everything else. <clears throat> now, mind you, I've never made it with the buttermilk. So, I don't know. Like, you know, you might want to pour more buttermilk, less. I'm not really sure. Because I've never made it with buttermilk before. Yeah, you have to play with that consistency because the buttermilk is a little thicker. Mm -hmm. you're like, yeah, you got to mess around with it. Mm -hmm. Bomb, y'all. I'll give you a... Mm. Oh, so good. Thanks, Mom, for helping me. Thanks I didn't for, do much, but you're welcome. Thanks for taste testing. You still oh, let live testing. on Facebook. Taste testing. I was eating. <laughs> oh, yeah, I haven't ended the live just yet, y'all. Can you describe the taste? Mm -hmm. You can taste it. The taste is... I can't even describe it. The buffalo. I don't... I can't describe it. Yeah. I don't know. Everything mixed together is... Mm, that's kind of a hard description. Mm -hmm. it, it is kind of hard. Thank you. I'll try it. I'll, I think I'd use potato instead of peppers, but I bet it would be good. Mm, like some, um, like some, uh, what is it? The, um, like a loaded potato. Uh huh. Some That'd be bacon, good. Like that's good too. Yeah, that would be good. That would be good. Oh. One second, y'all. Yeah. I can see that being a loaded potato. But definitely would have the, the shredded chicken in there too. It's going to be really good. She said, My daughter just asked for potatoes, the same recipe. That would be good, like a loaded potato. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like green, green onions on it, like top of green onions, bacon. Good. Auntie right. was your sous chef. She was. Thank you, Mama. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. You need a show on Food Network. Ooh, I would love to be on there. Tell them, y'all. Tell them that, to have me on there. I would love to be on there. I feel like I add a little razzle dazzle, a little pizzazz to a show. Ooh. So I, one thing I want to focus more on, y'all, is making sauces. That's why I decided, because clearly I can just go buy a ranch, but I really want to make more sauces. So that's what I think you'll see in um, the stuff I'm, I'm doing going forward, hmm. is I want to try to pair everything with the sauce and just try to make, um, I mean, I'm not saying it got to be super healthy, but again, this is keto. This is a keto version of ranch. You know, like, again, the buttermilk doesn't make a keto, um, but because I'm kind of eating keto right now, this is going to be great for me to have this ranch to put on like my salads and other stuff too that I'm eating. You know what though? I don't think, you know, what? no shade to the ranch dressing that's, you know, at the stores, but I would prefer to have this. You do? Mm -hmm. I mean, because again, I, you could taste the difference huh? like in terms of how processed mm -hmm. stuff is. I mean, it's clearly processed stuff in here too. Right. But I'm talking about everything that it takes to make ranch. You could taste the difference. Right. It does. Yeah. I hope you enjoy your, this. I hope you enjoy your birthday. Thank you. I am one to turn up. Mm -hmm. ah, we're gonna yes. We're going to have a good time. Um, Listen, Food Network is my channel. That's my jam, too. I can sit and watch Food Network all day. And if I only had to choose, like, three networks, Food Network will be one of them for sure. Now I got to hurry up and make dinner before I go into the kitchen smashing everything. <laughs> like a fat, a fat girl at Debbie Snacks. The food in my kitchen ain't got a chance right now. I feel you. I'm, I'm very satisfied, though. Them gloves are perfect. They were good. And then I'm, we'll probably eat the rest for the game tonight the game come on in a couple hours but thank y'all so much for coming through and hanging out and thank cooking you. with me if you happen to miss the live or if you're coming at the tail end of it just go ahead and watch the replay and also check the description y'all for um the recipe for to make the filling for the poppers and also to make the ranch mm -hmm. you won't be disappointed mm -hmm. you will not be disappointed very delicious yeah so i'll be cooking more often y'all i'm cooking again i should probably cook at least like once a month Maybe more than that, but we'll see. I want to make sure I have something I'm excited about making, too. You know what I'm saying? So I have a lot of recipes that I've been kind of playing around with and thinking about doing. So I'll have some more stuff coming up soon. So thank y'all so much. I'm dropping a video tomorrow. Please check it out, y'all. I ain't even, I ain't even told you this. I don't think. <clears throat> tomorrow I'm doing a story time about how I auditioned for an erotic show. <laughs> I don't even know about it. Whoa. <laughs> Y'all. So tomorrow is a story time about how I auditioned for an erotic show. This is in 2019. 19? Mm-hmm. Girl. girl. <laughs> so I want y'all to check out tomorrow's video. I'm, what am you I guys. eating in the video? I'm eating breakfast tacos with some low-carb um, tortilla shells. So. Girl, you and your surprises. <laughs> it, it never surprises. Still love your Parmesan eggplant lasagna. That turned out good. I remember that we had that. That was good. That we was should good. make that again. That's another, yeah. That's With the, like the cutlets. That was good. 
Yeah, that was pretty good. Look at Auntie like, wait, what? Yeah, so y'all check out tomorrow's video. Mm -hmm. I need to actually go edit the video and put it out and also tell my mother what actually happened. It ain't even, it ain't really that bad, Mom. It ain't really that bad. Look at her giving me side eye. Y'all, I'm telling you. <laughs> she done learned so much about me since I've been I have, since you've been on YouTube. Y'all, she, she be like, what? And I'm like, oh, mama, before this video come out, let me tell you about whatever, whatever. She like, Rhonda, when did this happen? How did that happen? I'm telling you guys. <clears throat> what? Excuse me. You just full of surprises. And so then when you guys know, it's just like, I have just heard it moments before. <laughs> Lord Jesus. So yeah, check out check out the uh mukbang tomorrow. I'm eating, um, story timing, and that's it. I don't know. Maybe I'll cook once a month for you. You cook once a month for me? No, I'm talking about life. I'm taking over your show. So you gonna cook for more for them than you do for us? That's okay. They love me. Mwah. You what? <laughs> Wouldn't that be something, y'all, if she really was <clears throat> going live to cook? But she don't even cook, she don't even cook for us, okay? Wait a minute. I remember when I was working at when I was in banking, right? We Hi, Jacelyn. We would have the uh pilots, right? Uh -huh. And so I never wanted to cook anything, but my staff used to love the hot wings and the pasta salad. Mm -hmm. And so I was like, I don't know if I should I may go buy something, right? Because I didn't want to cook because I wouldn't cook at home. But I'm cooking for y'all. You know, I'm gonna have I'm gonna get questioned. Y'all. <laughs> Imagine my surprise when she in the kitchen whipping up pasta salad and wings. Oh! And to be like, you can have a wing, but like this is for the office. Like what? <laughs> how you making pasta salad and how you cooking for them and not us? Mm -hmm. I've done it a few times, so I, I did feel guilty. You should have. I, I did. I you should have guilty. You should have. But anyways, y'all, we're about to go ahead and get up out of here. Thank y'all so much. Hope you guys enjoy the long weekend. I uh, hope you guys are on the grill or in the pool or whatever you're doing. Just be safe, y'all. Have, a, Have good a good time. time. Have a good time, y'all. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate y'all. And again, if you're just coming into the live, please go ahead and run it back. I will um, add the recipe to the description. As soon as the video is uploaded on YouTube, I will add the, the, um, the recipe in the description. Ooh. What's up, Folo? Oh, am I saying that right? I hope so. Where you did that at? Pretty Folo. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. All right, y'all. Y'all have a good one. Take care. Yes, um, I will see y'all in. I'll see y'all in tomorrow's video. Okay. I'll meet y'all in the comments. All right. So that's it, y'all. Have a good one. You know, don't say keep good to yourself. Well, it's not a video. Oh, it you? is a video. Oh no, it's a lie. lie. I'm sorry. My bad. Come on, you want to say? It? Come on. Okay. Be, be, be good, good to, to yourself. yourself. Peace. <laughs> Says mom wanted to say it so bad. <laughs> It's crazy. <laughs> All right, y'all. Bye. Bye. <clears throat>